Hi boys and girls. So yesterday I had you think about living and non-living things. And today I want to start thinking about seeds. Seeds are, oh and Mossy's here. She's a, Mossy, living, she's, she's a living, a living thing. thing. Yeah, she sure is. You know, it's hard to believe when you look at something like Mossy that what I'm going to show you here in my hand is also a living thing. It's an acorn, isn't it? I bet you have them all over your yard like I do. An acorn is a seed, and a seed is a living thing. It's just that the plant inside it, in every seed, is asleep. And if you plant it and give it just the right tender loving care, that plant will grow. So, and some seeds are harder than others, though. I want to tell you that, boys and girls. But look at this. This acorn, do you know what it's a seed for? It's a seed that can grow into an oak tree. Look at, Mr. Keller's gonna show you the oak tree that's right here in my yard. Do you see? Look, this acorn was in the ground. I'm gonna hold it. Can you see it, I hope? And it actually sprouted. If we planted it again, it would grow up into a little oak tree. This is a little oak tree right here. So seeds are funny things. They don't seem like they would be a living thing, but they are a living thing that is asleep. There's a plant inside that is asleep. And if seed has just the right conditions, it can open up and it can grow. So I'm gonna read you this book today to give us more information about seeds. And you're not gonna believe this. You're not gonna believe who this character is in the book. Let me read a little bit and then we'll find out. Seeds, seeds, seeds. On Monday in early March, Jim the mailman called out, package for Buddy Bear. Buddy, you're in this book. How exciting is that? Sit with me while I read about you, okay? For me, asked Buddy, Jim read, it says, for Buddy from Gramps. Buddy carried the big box into the kitchen and Mama helped him open it. Inside were bags tagged and tied with blue string. Do you see the bags that you got here, Buddy? They're all different colors. Buddy lined them up and he counted one, two, three, four, five. There was a note from Gramps. Dear Buddy, have five days of fun. Love, Gramps. P.S. It's almost spring. Buddy picked up a bag. What's inside, he wondered. He and Mama read the bag. So he's doing the purple one first. Different and the same, different and the same. Count them, sort them, glue them by their name. And he takes out the what's in the purple bag. It's a little white bag and he dumps it out and he finds all kinds of seeds. And he notices that they're all different colors. They're all different shapes. They're all different sizes. And Mama says, he says, Mama, do big seeds always grow into big plants? She says, sometimes, but not always. Some small seeds grow into big trees, like my acorn, right friends? Grew into that great big tree. So what Buddy does is he makes a seed collection. He takes all these seeds that were in the bag and he glues them onto this yellow paper. See, he wrote Buddy's seed collection. And then he starts gluing them. And I hope you will do the same. That's one of your assignments today to start your own seed collection. But of course, yours is not gonna be called Buddy Seed Collection. It's gonna be called Cheyenne Seed Collection or Dominic Seed Collection or Jacob Seed Collection. Or Buddy Bears. Or Buddy Bears Seed, seed Collection. Seed collection. Exactly. I love seeds, says Buddy Bear. <laughs> Oops, he's falling down. Okay, so after they started the seed collection, it says Mama and Buddy had a snack. Seed, 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 said Buddy. He saved some apple seeds for his collection. So after his snack, he took the seeds out and he glued them onto his collection. And here's his collection. Okay, now he's ready for the next bag. On Tuesday, Buddy lined up the bags. He closed his eyes and pointed. Mama and Buddy read the tag. Look, 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 how do I grow? Put me in order, then you will know. And he gets a card, all these cards that show all the different stages of being growing and you have an assignment to do that too today boys and girls you're going to put your um 
beans in a baggie with your wet paper towel and you'll see how they'll sprout just like this. And you also have a paper that shows all the different stages of the seed growing, the bean growing. It says to start growing, seeds need oxygen from the air, the right temperature and water. A seed soaks up the water. The water softens the seed coat and makes it swell. The seed coat splits open and the seed begins to grow. The plant inside begins to grow. And you can see that the acorn had a seed coat. Well, it has a seed coat. See that? And the water got in there and softened it up. And then the um, plant was able to start growing. It broke open that seed coat. You'll watch that happen with your bean. And it's gonna look a lot like this. It says each seed grows the same kind of plant that it came from, said Mama. Inside each seed is the beginning of a tiny plant called the embryonic plant. Embryonic, said Buddy. Yes, Bud, the tiny plant has tiny embryonic root. A tiny embryonic stem tiny embryonic leaves and food to nourish the tiny plant as it starts to grow. That's what's inside the seed, the food. Food, said Buddy. I'm hungry. Let's eat. Buddy and Mama had a snack. Seed, 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 said Buddy. He saved some cantaloupe and watermelon seeds for his collection. When Wednesday came, Buddy said, another day, another bag. He's going to open the blue one now. He and Mama read, here is something you can eat. For the birds, it is a treat. Just for them and just for you, good nutrition energy too. Something to eat. I like this bag already, said Buddy. Buddy looked inside and he found a small bird feeder with a red roof and there were also two clear bags with seeds. Mine look different, said Buddy. The seeds for the birds still have their hard coats. The seeds for you have had their hard coats taken off and their insides toasted. And that makes them good to eat. And he's filling this bird seeder bird feeder with all the bird seed and buddy asks will these seeds grow inside of me if I eat them <laughs> no buddy they won't grow inside of you but the seeds we eat are good food full of vitamins and minerals and so he tasted them and he likes them and he saved one sunflower seed for his collection here it is here's the sunflower seed without a coat here's the sunflower seed with its coat on Thursday, Buddy said, this one today, Mama and Buddy read the tag. Glue these on, make a nice design, create a picture frame that is mighty fine. And boys and girls, you already did this for your Mother's Day gift. Remember how I gave you some beans and some sticks and you made a frame with your picture? You're doing exactly what Buddy did here. Oh, and look, he's having strawberries for his snack here. It says, Mama said, and strawberries are the only fruit with the seeds on the outside. Buddy added some bean seeds and some tiny strawberry seeds to his collection. And there they are. When Friday came, Buddy chuckled, which one should I pick today? I think I'll pick this one. He and Mama read, here are some things that you can sow. Water them, watch them sprout and grow. Though it takes a little while, surely this will make you smile. <laughs> Mossy's going and visiting people over there. Mossy, come on you!